Hello guys, today I'm just making a video to for another update of the PVZ world. Alright, as you see here, I've, I mean, I'm reworking the shop because I had the idea was remaking the shop because, I mean, it was broken in the first place. But hey, it actually now works uh, because Mojang actually fixed his shifting bug. So, thanks to it, as you see here, I actually can get teleported to the Giddy Park and back. Oh, and as you might see, that's kind of a sneak peek of remodeling Giddy Park, the plant base at least. And as you can see this one, hey, the Royal Guard's fixed, so I can actually defeat the Royal Guard, and it actually works, so yeah. Props to Mojang actually catching on to this and fixing it for everyone. I don't- I did not really like this bug, and uh, it, it just sucked. I don't- it did not really- it was not really fun to, uh, remake everything again, so yeah, thank you Mojang. And in this clip, as you see, it gives you the rewards again, just like it should. Oh, thanks to the shifting bug being fixed as well, look, Tyrone's Caverns. No more giant hole in the middle of the map, in the whole part of the map. And if you, if you dig, see, this, I didn't repair it by myself. Mojang actually fixed this. So, yeah, thank you Mojang. If you go in this mine shaft, you see it's also fixed. If you go over here to like the area where Minecraft would be, it's fixed. Oh, and this clip here that I'm showing you right now it is a sneak peek of a new map coming. I will not name it. You're just going to try to guess what it is. Anyways, yeah, Mojang, I'm really happy that you fixed this bug. So, yeah, thank you for fixing this bug. Uh, nobody liked this bug. It was not very fun. Also guys, um, as you might see here, I'm going to be showing you the early work in progress mod of the PVC Battle for Neighborville slash Garden Warfare mod. This mod is going to add weapons and cosmetics to the game. And it's also going to be attached to the PvZ world. Uh, so yeah, this mod is going to bring in the weapons so I can actually put in some more characters you can choose. So this is very good. And also it'll be kind of survival friendly. So if you put this mod in a survival world, you're going to be able to craft some of these weapons and cosmetics. And right now, there are several weapons in this that I made so far. More are to come. So, right now, we got the foot soldier's weapon. They got the scientist. You got the engineer. You got the all-star. You got the wizard zombies. You got the pea shooters. Oh, and this one I'm holding my hand, it is very special. It's a new weapon that's never been in Garden Warfare or Battle for the Reveal. So yeah, it's our custom character weapon. It's, come, it's going to be a character coming with that new map I was showing you earlier. Anyways, right here, I'm showing you some, uh, what these weapons will do. So right now, as you see, it, I'm just testing it on the zombies. So it's very work in progress. So these will have 3D models eventually, but right now it just has the weird 2D model has to it. Oh, and the concrete launcher and the goo blaster. I forgot to put um, something to make it have infinite fire, but just wait for it to recharge. I forgot to add that in, so yeah, it's going to be implemented in the next update. So here's All-Star. Her All-Star's weapon. It takes a little while for it to shoot right now. I think I might uh, buff the damage a little bit because it's not very strong. The Wizard Staff is actually pretty good right now. The Orbra Cadorbra. Soul Blaster is going to be a new weapon that is going to do like a lot of damage and give the opponent slowness if it, they don't die. But the catch is, it's going to take a really long time for it to recharge your next shot, so you got to aim very carefully. So, yeah guys, that will be the end of the video. I just wanted to tell you like what's going on in the PvZ world and that hey, I'm working on the PvZ mod again. It's just going to be slightly different than, from what I was originally going to do. So, 
AI heroes might not be a thing until I figure out how to make them use a ranged weapon. But until then, guys, I'm going to catch you in the next video. Catch you next time. Thank you.